Look who's here. Let's see. Why there is Nick. a like you all see stuff. There's a ghost. There's a ghost. Maybe it's a ghost. No, you like well, you know, you know our school name, right? The school name? Yeah. Yeah, ULC, right? So yeah. ULC staff, they're just the people who work at my school. You 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 know Nancy, right? You know Nancy? Yeah, Nancy. Maybe Nancy's watching. We can say hi, Nancy. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's Nancy, right? Yeah, you're the you're yeah you're the first one. Hmm. How many people do you think we'll get today? I don't know. Uh... Hmm. Maybe a couple. We'll see, because we have we have you here, and then we have people on the on YouTube. Maybe somebody watching on YouTube too. So, should be good. So. Let's see. Oh, Macy, not okay. Somebody else, not somebody else is watching. Not, not Nancy. No Nancy today. Just Macy. So, I guess Nicholas. Maybe we have. Maybe we can talk for a second to see how you're doing. I know you're still, still in the up in the hotel, right? Yeah. Still hotel hotel life. Yeah, hotel yeah. life. With my mother. Yeah, hotel life with your mom. Yeah. Yeah, is it bo is it sometimes a bit boring? Yeah, very boring. Oh, uh, very boring. But sometimes I gotta be very busy. Too much work to do. Oh, okay. But maybe you stay busy, right? You can stay busy. You could say I. You could say I keep myself busy. Yeah. I keep myself busy, right? Because I know you. What you study English, right? What else do you do to keep yourself busy? Only study English can keep myself very, very, very busy. Really, you just you just study, 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 study. And I really? You study. <laughs> yeah, you study with me. Maybe you study somewhere else too. Yeah, lots of study. Yeah. Do you? Oh, do you? Do you? Uh, like uh, my? Whoops. My uh, my parents, they they play board games. Board games. Do you play games like this? Um, board games? I, I don't. I, I don't know how to. Uh, yeah, I, I can, but I, I don't. Yeah, I don't. board. If I hello. do board games. Oh, hello. Do you remember hello, me? Hello, hello. Yeah, from yeah, from a while ago. Yeah. So yeah. I so I know your name is Apple on here, but let, I think I can change it if I click rename. I'll change you to Stanley. Yeah. Success. Yeah. Yeah, so good. Now we got a couple people. We got, we got Nicholas. We got Stanley. We got Mike. We're getting Emma. Now we got a whole group. There's everybody. Right? There's everybody for today. Right? So Stanley, where are you now? Are you in Singapore now? Or are you in a different country? You're in Singapore? I will not come back. Yeah, right. So maybe you're you're <laughs> you're there, and then good. I see Mike. I see. Let's see. Anybody else? Oh, Yukiko. Okay, good. Now everybody's here. <laughs> slowly, slowly. <laughs> now we got everybody. Everybody. There's everybody. And I think even like maybe some of these people you haven't seen before, right? You can say you can see each other now. There's everybody. Hello. Hello. So, hello. <laughs> so, uh, for us today, for us today, we're going to talk about uh, something called shadowing. So, that might be a fancy word. So, I'm going <laughs> to I'll show you guys what shadowing is, right? And I'll go back to uh, back to my paper. Let's see, right here. Good. So, if I say shadowing, 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 shadowing. So, maybe you guys know what a shadow is. Shadow. Anybody know yes. shadow? Yeah, what's yes. Yeah. What's 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 a uh, what's a shadow? Uh, when you stand under the sun, you yeah, will good. have you a stand, shadow. <laughs> yeah. You stand under the sun, and then you have a shadow, right? Yes. Sunny day, we always have a shadow. 
So, yeah, like if you put your hand up, my light is up here. Yeah, my hand yeah, is yeah, here. light up. <laughs> yeah, I see it. It's, it's black. Uh, there's, a, <laughs> there's, a famous, uh, uh, there's a famous movie. Let me see if I have, not, not, not the drinking fountain, but Peter Pan Shadow. Peter so, Pan Shadow. Have you ah! ever seen, have you seen this movie? You guys? No? This movie, not, but no. I know no. the Peter Shadow. Peter Pan. Yeah, so this is Peter. This is Peter and he's with, he's with his shadow like this. Mm. Peter and his shadow. Mm. So Cut. that's that's what yeah that that is a shadow, shadow. Okay. Shadow. So when, in English, when we say shadow, you often did this with your teacher when you were younger, right? Whoops. With your teacher when you were younger, maybe your teacher would say words. He'd say apple, uh, pineapple, or maybe or what watermelon. <laughs> Uh, English, mm -hmm. uh, social studies. So what you would do in your English class, the teacher would say, and you would copy, right? You remember? Did you do this with your teacher? Yeah, Nicholas before, right? Would you like apple, apple, watermelon, watermelon. English, right? Oh. Did you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Did you do that with your teacher when you were young? Yes. Yeah, it's like repeat after me. So whenever whenever I say shadowing in English, what we do is we take what we see, right? It can be a video, it can be a TV show, it can be anything you watch. We're going to try to copy the sound. We try yeah. to copy the sound we hear. Okay? So to do that, I'm going to show you guys a short uh short film so if i go to here uh yes here it is so i'm gonna move it here and then i think you can see it now can you see the uh the yeah. left side i have it says shadowing a short film and then right side i have the video the video okay so what we're gonna try is I want you to listen and then we'll try to copy what the people say. Okay. So our listening, our listening challenge. Okay. So let me, let me see. I think it'll work. Yeah. Good. Share computer sound. I think we are going to be okay. So let's try. So right here. <laughs> I think it's kind of ridiculous you're not sitting down. <laughs> you, you, can, you, can you turn the, 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 the cat, caption on? The <laughs> captions, I know, okay, so I know you, you're like, I want to read it, right? <laughs> yeah, oh, I maybe. Don't, I don't mind standing. Yeah, I know you, like, I know Nicholas is like, Nicholas, you say, I want to read it, right? Sit yeah, you, you say, well, yeah, where are the subtitles, right? Right. But the thing is, Nicholas, what I want you to do is to try to uh, copy just the sound. Try to copy the sound. Oh. Can you do it? No. Can you copy, can you copy the sound? <laughs> yeah, maybe we, we can try. Yeah, right. Try to copy the sound. No subtitles. So no I'm going to take it back Ooh. if I go to 25 again. Just listen to the woman, try to say the same thing. I think it's kind of ridiculous you're not sitting down. <laughs> I can't understand without the subtitle. Maybe, okay, maybe, maybe I'll do an easier one. I'll do an easier one. Again, this one, all, this one also, I think I'll turn off the subtitles. Can I? Give me a second. We'll do an easier one. This one's a lot easier. Oh, can I do it? You know, do you know this guy? I'm ready. Okay, so again, we'll try without the sub. I'll try to. I know. I know it's difficult without the subtitles, but this one's a little easier. Ready? Hey. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm. 
I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> good, 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 good. He goes, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay. So, yeah, I think this one will be very fun. What is he doing? What is he doing, right? Do you guys know this TV show? Yes. Yeah, yeah what, what's this TV show called? Bang, people. Bang, bang, baby. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Sponge Baby. Sponge Baby. Yeah, so I know the first one, maybe the first one is too advanced. This one is okay, right? We try to copy the sound, no subtitles. This one, yeah, this one, the name is right here. It's called SpongeBob. Square pants. Okay, so first one easy. He says, I'm ready, I'm ready. Ready? I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. I'm ready. Go SpongeBob! Go SpongeBob! <laughs> Yeah, go SpongeBob. <laughs> go SpongeBob. Go Sponge. Yeah, what what does that mean? What does that mean? SpongeBob. 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 Yeah. Get it? SpongeBob is the yellow one. Yeah, he's good. SpongeBob is the yellow one, right? Yeah, SpongeBob is the yellow one, right? It's too hard. This one. Okay. Oh yeah, no, don't don't worry, Nicholas. This one is going to get more difficult. This is the easy beginning. <laughs> <laughs> It'll get more difficult. It will get more difficult. Ready? There it is, the finest eating establishment ever established for eating. <laughs> I was rabbit. Ready? <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Again, right? Doesn't stay easy. I need to. Oh no, maybe it's. Maybe I cannot find the spot. I'll go. Oh, here, back 10 seconds. Go, SpongeBob. Go, SpongeBob! Listen. There it is. How about that? There it is. Okay, good. You got it. There it is. There it is. Okay, and now, uh, Nicholas, is, the right? challenge. There, there it is. is. There it is. Right? He says, there it is. Okay, ready? The finest eating establishment ever. Mm. The finest eating establishment? <laughs> Good, close, right? The finest eating. Uh, this, this, this word, establishment. Oh my God. Yeah, so this, this word is the difficult one, but the other word's okay, right? The finest eating establishment. And then he says, Ever established for eating. Ever established for eating. Ever good. Ever established oh. for eating. eating. Right? Oh, reading. Reading. For, for re reading. No, not reading, right? So. This would be what you can like. You listen. You try to think. What What did they say? The crusty crab. The crusty crab. <laughs> can you read crusty it? You see? Crab. Yeah, good. You see this one? The crusty crab. What's that mean? Can you guess? So sometimes when we're watching, we don't know the English, so we have to look at the picture. Do you see the crusty crab? Uh, yes. restaurant. Yeah. The, in, in good. The, the Krusty Krab is the restaurant. Name. Uh, See oh, it on the so sign. Crab. I think that oh, is good, that's good, que good, that crab. good question, Nicholas, right? So sometimes in English, right? So this, yeah, you're right. This is the wrong spelling. Crab? What's this? Right? Yeah, we usually spell it like this. But because it's a children's TV show, they sometimes will do... This is funny. Right? This is funny for children. They're like, ha. Ah. <laughs> right? right? They use the K, not the C. Right? So, and then we're just going to hear a little bit more. Don't worry. Just a little more of this one. Home of the Krabby Patty with a help wanted sign in the window. A side in the window. <laughs> okay, close, close, good. Well, again, we can go back 10 seconds. 
The finest eating establishment ever established for eating. The Krusty Krab. Home of the Krabby Patty, with a help wanted sign in the window. Oh. Help. Right. Right? What's in the window? What's in the window? The help sign. Good. A, right? There's a help wanted sign in the window. Okay. A help wanted sign in the window. So I know that one that I know this is very difficult without subtitles, but I do want you to try to listen and copy. And then now, right now that you have the idea, now we can now we can use the subtitles, right? So I'll, I'll open this one up. And you guys remember the, the Netflix thing I used before where I can see the subtitles. Right. So if I select the subtitles, I'll get the English subtitles on here. And I'll go back to my my friend SpongeBob. Where'd it go? So right here. I'm ready. <laughs> okay, ready? So now we're going to watch it again. This time you can read. And when you're watching, I want you to try to say at the same time. So uh, for I'll give you the example. Let me see. I'll show you my example. So I'm going to mute you guys just so you can hear me copy the sound, right? So right here, we have the video, and then I'm going to go like this. I'm going to go, I'm, I'm ready. ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. right? Oh, oops, sorry, like this, there it is. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Go SpongeBob! Whoa. There it, there it is. is. The, the finest, finest eating, eating establishment, establishment ever established for eating. eating. The Krusty Krab. Home of the Krabby Patty with a help wanted sign in the window. For years, years I've, I've been dreaming. dreaming of this moment, right? So did you see what I did? Right? I watched the video, but I also want to try to have the same voice. Right? I want to also have the same voice. So... Yeah, I know. For this, usually you have to have a quiet, maybe a place, uh, uh, maybe go to your room, right? And what you want to do is you want to listen and try to copy, copy the sound. Okay? Can you guys do it? Can you try? <laughs> yeah. We'll go. We'll go back to our. Uh, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Right? You re Are Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, so I'll mute you guys again so you can, so I, we don't all hear each other. But, uh, right? But uh, at home, I want you to out loud say the same thing as SpongeBob. Okay? You say the same thing. All right? So let's try. Okay? And again, I'm going to mute. Let's go. It is the finest eating establishment ever established for eating. The Krusty Krab, home of the Krabby Patty, with a help wanted sign in the window. For years I've been dreaming of this moment. I'm Did you get it? <laughs> it's hard. It's difficult, right? Is it difficult? It's really difficult. <laughs> yeah. Too difficult it's too, for me. It's too fast, right? So, but the thing is, right? When we, if you, I know all of you guys want to uh, improve your English, right? When we speak in English, like when you hear the teachers speaking in English, they speak really, really fast, right? Or maybe you have friends who speak English, they speak really, really fast. So you want to try to also practice your sound, practice your speaking, oh, right? Speak not as far, not as fast as SpongeBob. SpongeBob not too fast. I know SpongeBob is very fast. <laughs> SpongeBob, <laughs> SpongeBob speaks very quickly, but um, SpongeBob's just a fun way that you can practice, right? You can find a story you like. I know uh, the other teacher, Matt. You know Matt, right? Yeah. Matt used Friends. 
he used the TV show Friends. Maybe you guys know that one. You know Friends? Yeah. Friends. It's, it's like the... I, I think, like Friends. You like Friends? So... Yeah. Like yeah. if I... I think I have Friends. Hi. Like... Yeah, so friends, you can do a similar thing, right? Where you would try to copy, right? You want to copy the same sound, right? Uh, another way to do this, another way to do this is actually in your, a lot of you guys, in your textbook. In your textbook sometimes, maybe I can find an example. In your textbook, sometimes they do the same thing, right? Like, uh, let me do... I'll do my class from today. I'll find a good one. Uh, or maybe, yeah, maybe they actually, maybe since Yukiko's here or, or Nicholas is here, I can find from your book. Where's a reading? Right? So sometimes even your textbook, you can copy the sound, right? You could copy a story from the textbook and read it out loud to practice, right? So that's also okay. So anything like that. So that's, yeah, that's my shadowing. <laughs> that's my shadowing, that idea. And hopefully, if you practice this a lot, when you listen, you'll be able to hear, you'll be able to hear the English quickly. Because I know in class we practice English very slowly, right? Sometimes we practice English slowly, but we want to practice English more quickly okay so any video like that do you guys watch you watch on youtube or do you watch on netflix or do you like to watch english videos in english yes yeah, yeah. we do this every day <laughs> every day do you ever speak uh, sometime, uh, sometimes shadow, shadow. oh you, sometimes, you sometimes shadow. shadow yeah so Ideally, we want to shadow more because I think a lot of us are listening. We can practice listening. We can practice uh, watching the video, but we don't speak, right? Mm, yeah. Right? We don't speak, so we have to speak, right? We have to speak. So how about, uh, I guess, Kelly or Yukiko, do you ever practice this? Do you read out loud? Practice out loud? Yes. Yeah. Yeah? Sometimes? Yeah. yeah, right? It's it is again a good even I get like like I said, I need to find I need to find a good story from your textbook. Um, but even your textbook sometimes has stories, right? Sometimes your textbook has stories you can you can use. Right? Like I'll I'll show you one from our other book. I finally I found it. <laughs> Oh, there it is. Okay. So right here, this is from one of our books. It's about airports. Right? So it says, top airports in the world. Whoops, there it is. Okay. And my students studying this book, some of them for homework, I tell them, try to read this out loud. Try to read this out loud. So not not only like this. You know, you usually read like this, right? It's like reading, 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 right? Yeah. But at home, you can practice. You try to speak the words, right? Just like we do in class. So we say, for many people, airports are a nightmare. Long queues when you look when you check in and go through security. Right? right. So that's another way you can practice that using your voice, right? Using your voice and sometimes you can even record. You can even record. So for example, I have, I have a student who uses WhatsApp to record and message me. So 
It sounds like this. To think it was to, Whoops. to be uh, ambitious and adventurous. Right, so she's using a different book, but she will record on her WhatsApp. <laughs> she will record on her WhatsApp to practice, right? Have you ever recorded yourself speaking English? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Mm. What, why is that a yeah? Why is that a good idea? Like why? Why should you record yourself speaking English? You can know your different ways native speaker. Yeah, good. You can check your pronunciation, right? Mm. We could you even can, do sponge. Yeah, yeah. Or get Mike, right? Yeah. You can make you and, understand the meaning. Oh, okay. Good. You can. Uh, yeah, you can. I guess you could double check the meaning, right? Double, double check, check the meaning. The meaning. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you listen again, 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 it will be easier for you to understand, right? So you can understand pronunciation, get the meaning. Yeah, and just like we did with SpongeBob, you can see. Can is, is my is my English similar, right? Is my English similar to SpongeBob? Right? SpongeBob is a native speaker. SpongeBob is a native speaker. His English is very good. <laughs> so can you sound right the same way as SpongeBob? Right? SpongeBob. Okay. Oh, oh uh, Mike, do you remember SpongeBob? The, uh, the, uh, the teacher's name? Oh, SpongeBob, oh. Yo, the, the cartoon, <laughs> yeah. cartoon the TV. Yellow, yeah. yeah. Oh, so, oh, yeah. Baby. So, yeah, the, the Sponge Baby, right? So, yeah. So, that, that's how we can use, right? Videos. Videos can help teach you, right? Mm, sure. Yeah. Right? So, that's how we can use the video, but... Not only watch, not only watch, right? We have to try. Oh yeah, or Kelly. Yeah. Yeah. Last month, I I record a PPT part for my daughter. My daughter. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I recorded a part. You recorded a video. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that can be very good, right? Like uh, even some some students they will record sometimes. They record uh, a conversation, right? So, like you could you could even if you want to practice, you could write. Then you could you could read, right? Read yeah. out loud, and then you can record. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah. Oh, maybe we could write a story. You guys want, yeah. I finished my shadowing, so we could do a story now. Can you think of a good story we could tell? Could we write a story? Hmm? I forgot. Yeah, a oh, story. If we do a story, uh, what story can we do? We don't have to do SpongeBob. Do you guys have a favorite character? Or a favorite book? Oh, yeah, I have a book. You have a book you like? What what book do you like, Emma? Oh, I just uh, read an English name. Uh, no worry, be happy. Oh, don't. This one. The, don't. the, the book name, no worry. Like this? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. Is it a good book? Your book. Yeah. Good. Don't. I thought uh, write uh, oh, protect. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. It's a book. Why worry? Be happy. Oh, why worry? Not don't worry. Oh. Ah, why worry? <laughs> Children book. It, is it for children? <laughs> it's for teenager. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Book, any book like that is good, right? 
Why worry? Be happy. Yeah, I think this is not、oh. difficult, not easy. You can understand. Oh, this yeah, this book is very cute. Good, I like the. Looks like a good book. Yeah, yeah. recommend it. You recommend it. <laughs> you recommend it to us. It's a good book. Yes.、Ah. Yeah, I think、uh, for learning this book is bad. Yeah, it's right. It's a good book. So yeah, so that's the great thing about、mm -hmm. uh, English. There's so many things you can do with English, right? You can read, you can watch, right? So the goal, I guess, the main thing is to do it every day, if you can, every every day, right? A little bit every day. So、uh, yeah, so again, I'll, sh I'll show you the book from、uh, Emma. This one is very cute. Here's the book that Emma recommends. <laughs> Looks like this. Pretty cute. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> For children. So that's yeah. For Emma's book. How about uh, what uh, Kelly or Nicholas or Yukiko? Do you have a book that you're reading? Yeah, my my daughter, my daughter. Reading. Yeah, your daughter. Making me laugh. What reading, reading you a book? Yeah, reading my 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 daughter book. <laughs> oh oh okay, your daughter. Oh very loud, right? Yeah, your daughter. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Your your microphone maybe is a little strong. <laughs> Japan, Japan, uh, Japan. Uh,、yes. hmm. So, I、uh, maybe I can hear. She's reading a Japan book. Or what? Ah,、yeah, oh, a story from Japan.、Yeah. Story from Japan. Yeah. Or let's see. Or any easy, yeah, any easy book you can try to read, right? You can try to read. So. So good. So I think, yeah, I think we got some good books. I have the Emma one.、Uh, I always recommend. I would recommend a story called、uh, Doctor Seuss. Do you know Doctor Seuss? No. No. I don't. Oh, I can show you Doctor Seuss. So Doctor Seuss.、Uh, yeah, let me go back to my back to the iPad. Doctor Seuss. Come on, computer. Doctor Seuss is a famous、uh, writer for children. So, if I got him here, there's my Peter Pan. Here's our Doctor Seuss. He has some very famous children's books. Have you have have you seen these before? No, I have a cat. You've seen this before, Nicholas? Yeah, the cat in the hat. Yes, this one. Yeah, the cat in the hat. All right. So. Yeah, books like this can be very, very useful, especially like、uh, Yukiko, Kelly, right? You guys, these are easy books, easy books that children often read, right? So you can also read these for fun. Read these for fun to、uh, to check, right? If I have the cat in the hat, oh yeah, here's an example, right? So you can even read this one now. Whoops! Oh. Come on, picture. Okay, maybe I add two photos. Okay, there's my cat in the hat.、Right. Why? Mom, that this picture. Good. No. no. <laughs> okay. Oh, somebody has a phone too. Yeah. Yeah. So a book like this, right? Okay. You can read for fun, and the the thing I like about Dr. Seuss is he rhymes. He will rhyme. Do you guys know, you know, rhyming. Rhyming. 
What, what, or Nicholas, you know that one. What's, what's rhyming? It's like, like it has the same sound. English. You can read for fun. And the, the thing I like about Dr. Seuss. Whoops. Okay. Yeah. So there it is, right? Yeah, you can rhyme. We can use rhyming, right? So that always works. Right? Yeah, like here it says, no, go, right? So that's rhyming, rhyming words. So it can be very useful that way, right? There. Okay. And then the other thing you can try is you can find the YouTube video. So if you have a book, sometimes there's a YouTube video that uses the book, that will read the book. Okay. Family. Yeah. Or Get Epic. You guys know Get Epic, right? So Get Epic also will read the book. I'm reading so. the Fire. It's an audio book. Yeah. An audio book. Yeah. Audio book also works, right? So I can show you the I can show you the Dr. Seuss book. It looks like this. This is Dr. Seuss, a very special special kind of art. So if I turn that back on, whoops, like this. Okay, yeah, like this. That Sam I am. That Sam I am. I do not like that Sam I am. <laughs> So this book, again, not too difficult, right? This book is for children, right? So it has easy English, but you can listen and try to copy, right? Do you like green eggs and ham? I do not like them, Sam I am. I do not like green eggs and ham. All right? So this style. Would you like them here or there? I would not like them here or there. I would not like them anywhere. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Would you like them in a house? Would you like them with a mouse? I do not like them in a house. I do not like them with a mouse. I do not like them here or there. I do not like them anywhere. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Would you eat them in a box? Would you eat them with a fox? Right? I think you get the idea. <laughs> right? This is another easy way, right? And again, you want to try to read the same speed. Right? Some of you, I know, will read this very slowly. You're like, would you eat them? in a box would you eat them with a fox in a box with a fox <laughs> right so you want to do the same speed right would you eat them in a box would you eat them with a fox right you copy the same way just like children just like children do right not in a box not, not with a fox, fox. Not in a house, not with a mouse. I would not eat them here or there. I would not eat them anywhere. I would not eat green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Good, right? I think Mike's doing it. So we can even do the same thing we did with SpongeBob. We'll read, we'll look at this one more time and I want you to, uh, I want you to try to copy the same sound, okay? So let's try that, right? You listen, try to copy the same sound you hear from the video. From or there. Them with a fox? Not in a box. Not with a fox. Not in a house. Not with a mouse. I would not eat them here or there. I would not eat them anywhere. I would not eat green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Interesting. Have, Nicholas, have you seen this kind of book before? Yeah. So this is actually, this is how American children learn English. They read the book, they try to read the book, they listen to the book, right? 
many, 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 many times. Right? Many, many, many times. Right? So, like, maybe I'll get the parents here, like Mike, or I guess Yukiko, Kelly, you guys. For children, do you read to children sometimes? Do you read to children? Yeah? Think like young children. Do you open a book, read to them? Sometimes? <laughs> how, how many times do you read the same book with your children? Do you read the same book? Or do you always a different book? Always? Same book? Yeah. Middle school? Maybe middle school they do, they do a different book. But young children will often read the same book many, 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 many times. Right? Like, I think Nicholas is too old, right? Nicholas and Stanley are older. But maybe I'll, maybe I'll ask them. I'll ask the young group. Let me see if I do the young. I'll do the young group with Nicholas and Stanley. Right? You guys, did you have a favorite book when you were young? You remember? Probably a Chinese book. Oh, my mom didn't read that book to me. Never? Never. Never? Never? Oh, oh, my gosh. Never mind. Okay, never mind. Or Emma, did your, did your parents read to you when you were young? Oh. Yeah, maybe for Emma or... Never? No. Oh, maybe, I guess, maybe this is an American thing. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm older. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, when, when I was young, my parents would, would like, they'd get a book and they would read the book to me before okay. bed. Bedtime. Oh, or sorry, or, or Kelly, yeah. Kelly, you have to say? Before, before sleep. Yeah, before bed. We, we say bedtime story. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah, do you read bedtime yeah. stories? Or Yukiko, sometimes? Bedtime story? Yeah, maybe. Yes, sometimes. Yeah, so, right? Maybe even, even, maybe this can be your new English habit. You can read yourself an English bedtime story, right? Could you choose an English bedtime story? Easy English. Easy English. You could do a, I, I can remember, it could be a very easy English. Like Emma has her new book. Emma, before bed, you could read some of your book out loud. Speak your book, right? Yeah. To try to practice or for, again, Kelly, you or Yukiko, uh, you could even find a book like this, a book that your children, maybe young children might like. And again, just try to read out loud. Try to read a book like this out loud. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right? It's very cute. This book is very, very cute. Right? It's like, I would not, could not in a car. Right? Yeah, so easier English, okay. Emma is in the, uh, Emma, you're in the advanced class now, right? Advanced or upper? No, advanced. Or, uh, upper, upper. So she's in upper. She's in the upper class. So upper book, upper you can do a English book. Maybe pre-intermediate, elementary. You can find an easy book. Find an easy book. Nicholas, what book can you use? A lot of book in Epic. Yes, good. So Nicholas, his class, they have, uh, they have epic books. Epic books. So this is one we're using a lot with our younger, our younger kids. So uh, I guess you guys could sign up too. I think maybe Matt has shown you guys epic before. Epic is a uh, iPad, iPhone app for children. Looks like this. Yeah. yeah. So this one has children's books. Uh huh. Yeah. So this one also can be very, very good, right? And again, the name here it's called. Whoops. It's called Epic. Epic. Yeah. Yeah. E P I C. So you have to go to. Oh, oh maybe I can't see it. 
It's called Get Epic. So if you go to their website, it looks, I can type in the box, getepic.com, right? So this one has a lot of children's stories, all English. And sometimes it's very easy, like this one. Look, very easy. Right? Kittens or pounce on top of one another. This is how they play. Okay. On top of one another. Good. This one, you can also shadow. Right? You can also shadow the different books. Right? Or here, here. It's like pretty easy again. The... Uh, the story we'd have like kittens. <laughs> kittens. Kittens. Kittens are baby cats. cats. <laughs> they are often born in a litter of three to five. Good. All right. So even like this, pretty easy, right? You can try to find an easy book and practice. So I know this one may be too cute, too cute for you guys. Right? <laughs> and right, even the children's books, you can learn some new words like this. Like, do you know the, do you know the word cuddle? Yes, like hug. Yeah, this is cuddle. Cuddle. Do you see the kittens? Right? Oh, they... you can... oh, I never know that. I think it's one. Yeah, it's two kittens, two kittens. So, right? Again, the main thing, I just want you guys to read a lot. Try to read a lot if you can. Watch a lot. Speak a lot. English, right? Yeah, so they, we could have the, the kittens, they cuddle. You can even read just one page at a time, right? You can listen, right? There's a lot of different ways you can use these books, right? These are the cute words like, like cuddle. Here we say snuggle. <laughs> snuggle maybe with your daughter right when they were young right there's a lot of new words you can learn right snuggle what's me snuggle yeah so snuggle like like, like this oh it's like cuddle like cuddle so we had we had snuggle and then we had cuddle uh, right, same thing, right? You, uh, you can. It can be uh, uh, maybe a ba a young girl, young girl with her doll, or these two cats together, right? Right, mother, young, young, young son, young daughter, right? We had snug. We could have cuddle. We could have snuggle. We could have carry, carry. Uh, <laughs> not bad. <laughs> Yeah, you, you cannot do this with your son or daughter, right? Only the cat, right? Yeah, Mike, you cannot do this. Or Kelly, you cannot do this with your children. Why? Right? Yeah, I think this book is cute. It's so cute, right? So again, if you do it, yeah. Yeah, there are so many. There's some very, very cute books on here. Some very, very cute books. So, uh, yeah, you can even share with your, share with your ch children, share with your friends, right? Yeah, there's a lot of books, right? So many. Right? Yeah, so many. Right? <laughs> so. so, that's my books to read. The different books to read. Hmm. Great. Yeah, I, I think that's about it. That's all I had to say for today. So do you guys have any other questions you want to talk about today? No, no questions. No question. Emma, no questions. Yeah, I just oh. want the website is free or not. So this this one is I think it's I think it's free because of coronavirus. <laughs> for for now. <laughs> you got you guys you guys know some websites are free now because of coronavirus. Right there's a yeah because they want they want children to be able to read at home, so I think it is free now, okay. right? Yeah yeah yeah. So like, here if I if I go to their website if I go to their website, I think you I think you have a month, I think you have a month that can be free, 
So let, let me see. Uh, yeah, maybe here. You see, if you go to their website, getepic.com, right, mm -hmm. for the um, for parents, right, or for, I guess, you guys, if you want to be like a parent, it's 30 days are free. And then, um, yeah, and us teachers, we have until the end of June. So same as that, until the end of June, right? Uh, the teachers have it for free. Yeah. So yeah, it's worth it's worth a try. If you guys you have one more month at home, you're stuck at home, right? Yeah, you're stuck at home, so you can you can try this at home. How about students? Well, Nicholas, you already have, right? Yeah, I already have. Yeah, because Nicholas is part of our student. Two epic. One is my school, and one is yours. Yeah. So you, yeah, Nicholas has two accounts already. Wow, he has two accounts already, but. I think it's worth it. I think it's very, very useful. Um, there's a lot of books you can, again, read. You can read to practice, or your children can can all. What? Yeah, yeah, a lot of good books you can you can practice with, if you want to try, right? So maybe try when it's free, and then when it's not free, you can use YouTube, because that's the other. The free one I recommend is just YouTube, right? Just, just mm -hmm. like this book, right? Just like this book with the green eggs and ham, right? My, uh, could you eat them in a car? Eat them, eat them, here they are, right? <laughs> this, all I did was I say, read aloud, right? Or read aloud. So I typed this in. You could say, uh, there's a lot of books for children, right? See? A lot of, usually children's books, you can find them read aloud for you just like just like this okay on youtube would you could you <laughs> would you could you in a car right so all of those yeah yeah so that's 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 the that's the idea hopefully you can right uh, yeah, maybe la finally we'll just do a little talking. So you guys, do you have any plans for the weekend? Nope. Well, Nicholas, you have on Saturday. I know what you're doing, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Nicholas can now go out. <laughs> Nicholas, Nicholas is going to be in the hotel every day. Every day. Ho every day in the hotel. Nicholas will be in the hotel. Uh, Yukiko, this weekend. Party? No party. No party? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Stay, stay home. Stay home? Yeah. yeah maybe. You're staying home. Yeah, you got I'm staying home. Uh, maybe Stanley, do you have any plan this weekend? Um, I am going to add hotel also because I'm going you're back at, to China tomorrow. Oh, you're, you're in a hotel too? No, like I, I'm going back to China tomorrow. So I will be in uh, there. Okay. Yeah. You're also in a hotel. You guys have the two weeks, right? Uh-huh. The two weeks. Uh, yeah, you're stuck. It's halfway already. Oh, you're, half, you're halfway done? Yeah, I'm halfway done. Okay. One week in the hotel. One more week in the hotel. So, okay. And I guess the rest of you, yeah, don't, don't go home. Yeah, I won't. Yeah, don't go home yet. So, yeah, Nicholas has to go home. Stanley home. I think Kelly, you'll stay in Singapore, right? Kelly will stay in Singapore. <laughs> Kelly or Mike. Mike, I think he's also staying in Singapore. Maybe sleepy. I think maybe Mike fell asleep. <laughs> yeah, Mike? it's okay. I, I think you see Mike. I think Mike, maybe he fell asleep. Yeah. <laughs> he's very tired. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, he's maybe. He's not stuck. He's not stuck. Is he frozen? Oh, oh no, he's. Oh, maybe he's there. Hi, oh. Mike. <laughs> I don't know. I think Mike. Maybe Mike. Maybe he fell asleep. Oh no, is he? Is he there? Yeah. I mean, just wake up. It's okay. I think that's. I think that's it today. <laughs> uh, Mr. Mark. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, can you stay behind? And I have something to show you. You want to show me something? Okay. Okay, may, maybe I'll, I'll end. I think nobody's on YouTube now, so I'll end the YouTube video. And then if you guys want to stay, Stanley has a show and tell. 
he wants to show us something. So, yeah, so that's okay. I will, I'll end our YouTube. Goodbye, YouTube people. See you later, YouTube. And then, uh, yeah, then Stanley, what, what do you have to show?